Hey guys and welcome back. So today I'm going to be talking all things passes, about how to best use and utilise your passes. Obviously there is no free way of getting more passes. The only way to get like free passes would be to become a featured writer and I mean the things if that's what you want to do good on you but for a lot of people they don't have the time to do that and obviously the only other way to get unlimited passes would be to like pay like a monthly thing like you do for Netflix and and that costs a lot of dollar, a lot of dollar that you might not have. I don't have it. So these are just some little tips and hacks that I've had a little look around on the internet to see what I could find and I've asked Joe as well. And yeah, here they are. So number one is something called streak challenges. Now this was something that I was trying to find on um, the episode forums which is a good place to look to get like loads of information on episode. But I couldn't seem to find much on this. So if anyone has got more details about that, then just comment that down below. But I seen this, not on my episode, but I seen it on Joe's because I was having a look at both of ours to see if there was anything different. And there was, but I took a screenshot for you. So it is called Streak Challenges. That's what it looks like. So you can see there's like a little icon down there and when you click on that this comes up so this says read four chapters before the time runs out to earn a pass complete this challenge and come back tomorrow for even more rewards so i don't know what happens if you do that and then like you continue because there's one two three four five seven of the little dots so this was like day one so i don't know what happens if you get like the full seven maybe you get extra passes but like i said if anyone's got any more information then just leave that down below but I mean, that seems like a cool way to get an extra pass. Number two is to time yourself strategically. So basically episode have stopped the stacking up of passes. So I was under the impression, but Joe has now told me that this has changed, that if you had say three passes that were left, then when the four hours are gone by, you would then have like the three and the new four. This has since changed. So now you can only get four passes every four hours and if you don't use those passes then those passes are gone but the sooner you use your passes the sooner you get the new ones so i'm thinking if you're in school or work and you want a break use up your passes so say it's like two o'clock you want a break use up your passes even if you're not particularly interested in the story just to use them up so that when you finish work or school say at four o'clock then you've got the passes waiting there for you essentially the sooner that you use your passes the sooner that you get the replenished passes so obviously you, you could you could just use one pass if you haven't got the time but i mean if you've got time to use up your four passes then i mean you may as well so tip number three uh this is more so if you're new to episode and you might not know this but if you've read under 20 episodes then i think you only get two passes every four hours so if you read 20 chapters then you'll get three passes every four hours and if you've read 40 chapters you get the maximum four passes every four hours obviously if you're a regular on episode then this probably isn't hard at all but just if you're new you might not know this or you might be wondering why you're only getting two passes then that's why so number four is giveaways so at one point i think episode would like reaching out to a lot of people on youtube and in the episode community i don't think they've done that in a little while but i mean i would just keep checking just in case if they suddenly start doing it again i've got got a little list here i was having a look on youtube so jen creates i'm hoping i'm gonna say this right yogs cast hannah i'm really sorry if i'm like butchering your name and gems are called they've all done giveaways in the past so maybe keep an eye on their youtube just in case if they do giveaways again and again keep an eye on the forums just in case if there's any giveaways happening in there as well tip number five is more of kind of like a what not to do please 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 do not use these generators anyone who says that they can give you unlimited free passes and gems just it's a scam i'm gonna probably guess that there's gonna be a lot of people who are commenting down below this video saying or if you follow this link or i've gone on this 
website and it's worked please 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 don't do it because all that is is a scam to get your information and your money and i do not want that for your future so guys there's just some little hacks and tips on how to utilize and get the most out of your passes and if you guys got any more tips or hacks on how to like utilize your passes which aren't generators i'm watching you watching you then just leave them down below I mean, let's spread the joy to the fam. Thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Do you even have a pet if you're not covered in fur? Do we see the fur all over me? Am I just lint rollered? We're not even in the same room. She's just like spreading her fur everywhere. I don't have false eyelashes on today, and I feel bold. Bold, I tell you. And if you think that I look more tanned, because I did as fake tan. And I also just done my nails on the cold bath. That is. <gasps> I get it everywhere. How, like, refresh am I? Should I have waited to film until this was all cleaned up? Maybe.